Hey guys, how are you? My name is Renata. Welcome back to my channel where we're going to learn by drinking. And on today's episode, we're going to discuss about a wine that it's really, really getting trendier and trendier as we speak. And it's a really interesting wine. We're going to talk about white Pinot Noir. This is the one I'm going to talk about. And you're going to tell me, Renata, but Pinot Noir is a red grape. Yes, it's a red grape, but you can make white wines with red grapes. For example, Pinot Noir is one of the main varietals in Champagne. So yeah, you can make great white wines with red grapes. Um, the white Pinot Noir can range in different colors. For example, like a deep gold, like this one that I have here. It can go all the way to a deep saffron color, depending of course on the, of the production and of the region where the wine come from. So the main producers right now for white Pinot Noir are Oregon. I have one here that's from Oregon. Oregon is located on the west of the United States on top of California. The second producer is California, of course, because they kind of share the same climate and the same weather conditions. Also, Germany is producing Alsace and Italy. So this one that I have here, it has like a deep nose, like apple baked, like baked apples, baked pears, maybe nutmeg, a little sweet spices, maybe saffron, cinnamon, and maybe some honey at the end, and a little butter on the palate. Mm. Structured wine. It's kind of in the, I want to say, in the medium dry, not that bone dry. It has medium acidity. Um, you can taste uh, the pear, the apple, the nutmeg, what we talked about, but also you can add a little bit of acacia honey, maybe. Let me give it another try. Mm. The flavors are so full and also the it's not a wine that's big in alcohol, so it can pair perfectly with a lot of things. You can pair a uh, white Pinot Noir with shrimp, seafood, a lot of seafood, sea bass, scallops, um, even with cheeses, with bread. Also, you can pair it with pasta, maybe some pasta with seafood, with some oysters or some um, mussels or scallops, and also with truffles. It would pair perfectly with truffles. Maybe a, a pizza, a truffle pizza will go perfectly with this one. Um, the white Pinot Noirs can be oaked or not oaked, depending on the producer. And there's also a third classification that is called Bingri, Binogri, or Bangri, that is uh, the rosé type of the white Pinot Noir. This one that we're having here is from Adelshine Vineyard, which is really popular and really good. So if you can take a hand on the white Pinot Noir, it's a great option for spring, now that the bad weather is going. Um, you can you can totally um, find this refreshing and and deep too much alcohol not too much acidity like a perfect balance of um, wine so I totally recommend it to you guys cheers um, remember to subscribe to my channel don't forget about that and tell your friends if you like the content if you want to know about any wine specifically any region any terroir if you want me to make a comparison between wines please let me know and see you on the next episode. Cheers, guys.